Hey there, I am another vlog here. Um, I am another vlog here, that doesn't make any sense. Anyway, yeah, so just want to do a quick vlog. Um, i saying that I want to let everyone know, if you don't know, today is the beginning of Sanctity of Human Life Week. Um, since uh, basically this is the week where people who care about such things are uh, you know, really trying to focus on doing things to prevent the genocide of the unborn and the elderly and or infirm that is going on not only in America but also around the world. Um, it's used to rephrase that in terms that are more universally understood. By genocide of the unborn and infirm I mean uh, I'm referring to abortion and euthanasia and like, you know, assisted suicide, that kind of stuff. So I just wanted to let everyone know that, you know, what's going on, and um, I'll include some links in the sidebars that will be uh, helpful for research and all that good stuff. Um, so, yeah. Just, uh, especially, it's kind of ironic that, you know, uh, in America, you know, the, this, you know, Sanctity of Human Life Week is falling in the same you know, so the same week that uh, a uh, new president is being sworn in, who has made it very clear that he is for the murder of the unborn, and will do everything he can to ensure that it stays in place. It's kind of sad and uh, ironic all at the same time. So yeah, I just uh, I encourage Christians across America and around the world to really be in a lot of prayer this week and. Uh, and really just and not to let it end this week either, you know, we've got to keep going all throughout the year. Uh, so I have to have these little times to remember these kind of things, but we can't let it end with this week. We have, you know, if we, if we say that, you know, we don't, we don't want abortion to be around anymore, we have to actually do something about it. And, but at the same time, we can't be judgmental on the women who have had abortions. But, you know, there's a lot of statistics that show that it just tears them up inside afterwards, and so we have to, you know, we have to be loving about it and just, you know, help them. And you know, if you're watching this and you have had an abortion, just know that you know God loves you and you haven't committed some unforgivable sin. Is the right turn? Is the right turn? Is the right turn? Um, no, next one. Uh, if you haven't committed some unforgivable sin, it's just uh, you know, you can. I mean, God still loves you and. Uh, yeah, so just you know, I encourage you to you know, I just pray that people will, that the Lord will bring people into your life that can to help you cope. So just uh, yeah, that's my little vlog for today. Uh, have, a, have a great day, everyone.